morning in the city of Newark, New Jersey. Congregants and loved ones came to say goodbye to Imam Hassan Sharif. The faith leader was shot earlier this week. He was found lying face down in the parking lot of his mosque. The gunman is still on the run. Eyewitness News reporter Reagan Meji was there as loved ones said goodbye. A wife loses her husband, a daughter loses her father, an entire community loses their friend, their brother, their father figure, their leader. Mourners slowly make their way into NIA, Masjid and Community Center in Newark as the Quran is being recited outside. He's a beautiful man. He has a, a message. He had a message for us. Someone who left, whose laugh was loud and his spirit was light. Out of a congregation filled with those who knew Imam Hassan Sharif, seen here preaching at Masjid Muhammad Newark. Stop bipping over who's this and who's that. Stop. No one knew the Imam better than his own daughter. Hassan was a great dad, husband, and a true pillar in the community. I cannot describe how it makes us feel knowing how many lives he touched. The Imam died Wednesday after he was shot. Police sources say he was found lying feet from his mosque with multiple gunshot wounds just after morning prayer. This community, hundreds, standing together in sadness and faith as they say goodbye. Because he was so well known in the, in the community, that everybody comes out. The Imam is very great man, and we come from all the way Philadelphia. May Allah give him Jannah. May Allah give him heaven. There is still no suspect, which makes Imam Sharif's death even more heartbreaking. To the killer, we'll find they'll find you. I'm sure of it. As the community continues asking police to step up its investigation, the Council on American Islamic Relations just announced a $10,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. And that is on top of a $25,000 reward being offered by Essex County Crime Stoppers. In Newark, Reagan Meji, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.